All right, welcome back to uh, 13 Days of Halloween. Indian Taste, 13 Days of Halloween, yep. 2014 edition. Yep. Um, today we're going to show you how to dress up as a jellyfish. Jellyfish. It's a really simple, pretty cheap costume. Yes. There's one thing that if you don't have would make it a little bit more expensive, but if you already have it, like it's four or five dollars. Yeah. Um, so we're going to show you what you need to make it. Alright, so... Start off with the main thing. The main thing you're going to need is an umbrella. A bubble umbrella. A bubble umbrella. Shaped like this. Like the dome shape. Clear. Clear. It would be preferable if it didn't have these flowers on it. Yeah. Um, if it was just straight clear. But we can work around that. It just costs us a little bit more and take a little more time so we can cover up the flowers a little bit. Because we actually found this one. If you had to buy one, they're like $15 at Walmart. Um, I think like Dollar General has them for like $8. Yeah, I found this one on the side of the road. So that's what we're working with. So. We were going to use my sister's, but we found one in the tent. So we're just going to show you how to cover up what's on it. If you have one that has something on it. Um, and then we have... Cheerleader pom poms from the Target dollar section. This is the package. Um, and we did that because we want this silver stuff. We're going to use the silver stuff to cover the flowers. Yes. Um, if you had a package of tinsel from Christmas. Christmas, that would probably work just as well if you needed to do that. And then you wouldn't have to do all the like cutting. Yeah. There. But this was like a dollar. Yeah. And it's plenty. So, it's easy. Um, you need some packaging tape because you want it to be wide. You'll find out why in a little bit. And you're going to need scissors. And then the last thing you need is tool. You could probably use ribbon or something. Yeah, sort of ribbon other thing. or anything else. But Walmart had tool. For a whole roll for a dollar. It it's a, six yeah. inches wide. And the rolls were. Um, 60 feet long? Yeah, they were 20 yards, so that's 60 feet. So we cut um, like 12 out of each one. And they pretty much go from the end of the umbrella almost to the floor. And they're going to be like the little tentacles. Yeah. So, I guess we're going to show you what we're going to do. Yep. Alright, so we happen to know how long around the umbrella is because I already measured it. Yeah, that it's, would be step number one to measure that. Um, it's the length of this thing that this I have. This piece of tool. Um, and like one and a half. Almost, <laughs> almost one and a half. So, let's... We're going to do three halves of it, basically. We're going to do three sections. We're going to cut tape that long. While she's trying to find the end of the tape, I'm going to cut this stuff off of this. There's a zip tie that attaches it right there. You wanted to cut that first and then cut it in half. So you want your tape to be as long as your thing. We're doing it in sections of three because it'll be easiest that way instead of having this giant long piece of tape. It's all back. Okay. And then we're going to take pieces of this and we're going to stick it on there. If you happen to make it like this, that works really well. That. Somehow he cut it to where it's like a strand like this. That's That was luck. Yeah. Um, so we're just going to lay it like halfway up the, like three, um, quarters right three quarters of the way up the, the um, tape. So that you still have some tape to stick to the umbrella once you're done.
thing. This which, thing. <laughs> which you could probably wear as like a little like silver skirt or something. <laughs> um, but I think so that we don't um, get this stuck to something and ruin it, we should probably go ahead and put it on yeah, that's the what umbrella. Yeah, go ahead and put it on the umbrella. So. Okay, grab the umbrella. And Andy will stick it to it. And we're going to go. Okay. Just above okay. the flowers. Just above. What are you doing? I'm trying to make sure I don't ruin it. I had to get it to this side because I had the sticky side. Okay. Okay. Fish. Almost. Alright, so now we're gonna do this that two more times. Yeah, that covers that pretty well. Like, it's not a hundred percent, but like you can't really see what's underneath it that well. So it definitely distracts you from the fact that there's flowers on the Yeah. Alright, so we're gonna do that again. That went a lot smoother than I thought it was going to go because of the way that cut. That was Good call on pulling that, that, that thing off. The zip tie. Yeah. Okay, so now we have added all of our streamer stuff to our umbrella. Here's what it looks like. Spin it around. It's all the way around. Okay, so now what we're going to do is add the tool, right? Yes. We are going to take the tool, and we're going to take a purple piece and a blue piece and double them up, right? And then tape them to the inside of the umbrella. So it's gonna be like dangling out from underneath the stuff. And you'll have like a double color tentacle y thing going on. So we're gonna show you exactly how we do one, and then we're probably gonna like do the rest real fast and show you the finished product. So I'm gonna get this tape. So you want to start by taping the two together at the top, so they stick together. Wait, aren't we going to like bunch it at the top? Yeah. I guess we could still like fold it. And like we could fold it and then tape it because then it'll kind of like... You can even do like how you want to do a tube. You yeah, do that. that's not going to keep up the whole thing. That's yeah. fine. Yeah. So once you tape them together, you want to kind of like create a circle and like fold the two pieces in so it creates a little kind of a tube. And then you're going to tape that to the inside of your umbrella. So we're just going to put one. Um, thing like this at the end of, well not at the end, but where the like thing comes down, you've got your little point behind that like on the little poles. And we're just going to go around and add one to each pole. Right 
So here is one jellyfish tentacle. You can kind of see it taped. And we're going to go ahead and do the rest of them. So once you have completed the taping on of the tentacles, your thing should look something like this and then you could wear like either like a blue outfit or a purple outfit just a solid color outfit um so you blend in you wouldn't wear jeans and a money shirt like andy's doing um but spin around and show them what you look like it looks like a jellyfish yeah so this is our jellyfish costume um if you like this video click the like button Share this video, comment, and subscribe, and happy Halloween! Happy Halloween!